Hello YouTube and uh, welcome back to the Vinnie G channel. I'm just going to try and get out of the way here so you don't see my reflection in the glass to spoil the video. Here is the retro front end fully installed on my arcade machine after I did the major download off emumovies.com. You don't get any of the games in the download, basically you get the setup, the artwork, the movies, the system configured and all that sort of stuff. I'm, I'm very happy how this has turned out now. This is only a fraction of the systems um, that's available from this download. I've actually got all the systems in but I've just hashed them out on the uh, file so they don't come up here because I'm... Look, it's, um, it's just a huge... Uh, project uh, programming this you like I said there's over 40 gigs of data and it's all um, testing and um, deleting and adding and all that sort of stuff so it's not um, just uh, playing the games or anything like that now you've got the Capcom systems which were arcade and they had the obviously the heavier games so games like uh, Street Fighter Third Strike um, it says here, now reading the CD-ROM, there is no moving parts in this. This is all done through emulation. It does function as an arcade machine. Um, what I did do is I stretched out the bezel a little bit on the screen there, so it, it wrapped the game and gave a true feel. The sound on this machine is absolutely tremendous. Drop a few coins in, just to give you a rough idea. I'm just selecting anything and... Uh, here we go. I'm just going to let this guy get beat up. So this is basically the extent of the games that um, are on here. You know, it's a pretty historical sort of machine. So there's no keyboard attached to it anymore. There's no mouse attached to it anymore. There will be obviously for programming and the door slightly ajar at the moment because I've still got a network cable uh, running into the machine. That's all the systems configured on it. Neo Geo, you know, the game collection is, is quite huge, you know. There's a movie for every game, so you can see what you're playing before you select it. There's still a lot more games to go in this, obviously, but, uh, you know, I've had a whole Easter weekend of programming this thing up. A lot of Japanese stuff in here, some of the stuff we never got to see. Now, some of you might know by some of the videos that I've got in the arcade section that I'm actually sort of like uh, addicted, I guess you could say, but I have a passion for arcade gaming. Look, I will never play a lot of these games, but to me it's about having the arcade machine, having everything available that I can possibly have on there. It's sort of like my jukebox. Yeah, I've got that game, if you want to try it, and you know, here it is and uh, all that sort of stuff, so... Um, I have got uh, Game Boy, Nintendo 64, all that sort of stuff ready to go on there. This is how it's set up. You've got the bezel wrapped around the vertical games now, so there's no black stripes on each side of the screen. It's Look, it was just an absolute huge... And, uh, you know, the whole setup as it works now, I'm so happy with this machine. This is how it'll be staying now. I'll just keep adding more systems to it, but... Uh, quick play of the, arc the original arcade systems, you know, from the golden age of arcade. So, thank you for watching. Um, I will keep updating the arcade um, videos as I go along and add more systems to it so you can see the final result one day. It's worth the download because you get the arcade machine picture, you get the movie, the system. Um, so here you would get some artwork and that's what you get the movie playing you know everything is in here and just these movie files alone for um these games you're talking gigs of of mp4s i think the format is on these so once again thanks for watching i will keep updating this project so if you like what i'm doing like and subscribe and otherwise we'll see you on the next one